everything. So hari ni punya video, I just nak buat uh, my concealer. I just want to talk about my concealer. So I will share with you guys my top five best concealer on 2020. Tadi lah on 2020. Tapi my top best concealer lah. So this is my concealer. So as you can see from here, this is my favorite concealer. So as you can see from here, um, korang dah tahu kot which one is my favorite. Kan, kan, kan. Nampak tak? Nampak tak? Okay, so first is, I would like to highlight, I dah pernah pakai concealer from Maybelline. The wine uh, age, whatever, yang dekat Maybelline, yang bestseller, yang ada penutup, yang trend 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 tu ah uh, yang tu I dah pernah pakai like I've been using that concealer since my high school sampai tahun lepas and then I change my concealer sebab I think that concealer is actually a very full coverage memang very good kalau nak tutup you punya dark circle uh, and everything macam celah-celah is very good tapi for me it's too thick. Dia macam tebal tau. That, uh, that concealer dia macam tebal. That that Maybelline concealer. But it's very good. Normal lah kan. Sebab masalah ni like. Dia orang suka pakai like. Like thick formula or something like that. So macam I. I suka formula yang soft. Like macam Korean jenis soft. Ada macam glow. Ada dia tak. Dia tak cover sangat I tak tahu lah apa function dia jadi concealer Kalau dia tak boleh nak cover But I like things like that So kalau korang suka thing like that You should watch this video The first is my top 2 This is my top 2 concealer First is from the same The same Korean brand And this one is from Rimmel London So this one is banyak gila kat drug So ada kat Watson Ada dekat Guardian Ada everywhere So you guys can easily get this but some people doesn't like it but some people like it so this is my preference so kalau korang jenis yang suka glowing soft tak khaki tak tebal you guys should get this but this one is really my top one tapi susah nak dapat ni because banyak fake so kalau korang nak beli make sure you guys get it from original websites contohnya macam wako and style Korean. So I'm going to try this concealer from the same. This is the concealer from the same. Okay, this is concealer from the same. And this one is concealer from Primo. Okay, if you can see for the application, korang boleh nampak this rimmel is actually more watery and tak, tak thick sangat. So, korang nak nampak kan? So, actually, the best concealer is the same. Tip concealer. This is sumpah very good. And I've been using it like for 6 months and dia tak habis. But I'm not using it daily. So, I'm not sure. But it really cover. Let me try this one. This one is from the same. I'm going to try here. So, that's the reason benda ni dia pakai tip concealer is you have to use your finger for more coverage. It's actually dia macam matte tapi this one tak keki macam Maybelline okay so this is the same I really like this one I tak tahu nak cakap macam mana but I really like too and then we're gonna try the second favorite of me I believe I dah sampai repurchase repeat order for this rimmel sebab I suka sebab I kalau keluar tak pakai makeup I will just use this one sebab dia watery and so so light so, the, my shade is 030 Classic Beige. So, kalau korang nak beli all the product that I mentioned here, you guys can click the link down the below. Down the below. Click the link below lah. Apa benda siap? Okay, this one. This one, actually very good concealer. Dia adalah Lasting Radiant. Which is, the akan give you punya um, skin radiance. It's not like full coverage. Dia tak Dia tak full coverage So they just give like a radiance Like a Korea Korea punya Like glowing Glowing Macam tu I'm not I'm quite like Merepek dua hari ni See nampak tak Dia like senang gila blend Dia macam See Dia tak coverage Dia just Radiant Faham tak 
Di macam like you top up your skin to look more radiant. So for Rimmel, dia tak coverage, but it's really good if korang suka benda yang light, uh, light textures, not very coverage, semi, uh, not matte and glow. You guys should get this uh, Rimmel. This is my favorite. I already repeat this or uh, repeat order for this concealer. This is so good though. I believe like I am tiga belas ringgit, what to fifty percent. If tak the sale pun is like um right around twenty. The original one is like this. It's so easy to blend. Dia tak senang kering. Dia tak matte sangat dia. Semi matte and it's actually very good concealer. I tak tahu nak cakap. You guys, you guys should get it and try it by yourself. Okay, next is matte concealer. Matte concealer atau orang panggil full coverage concealer. So, full coverage concealer. I actually suka benda-benda full coverage ni. Tapi, I nak benda yang tak likat. Benda yang tak tebal. Benda yang macam... Macam tak keki bila pakai. Tepat-tepat-tepat kan. Tak keki bawah mata tu. Uh, so, I have two option here. First is from Bonding Drop Concealer. From brand APU. From Korea juga. And this one is not cosmetic punya perfecting pen. So, I'm gonna highlight like all the brand. Kalau related to concealer, brand Korea is the best. I'm not cakap brand lain tak best like more better lah sebab dia like tak keki benda macam tu but some ada yang keki so korang kena pandai-pandai lah pilih so I'm gonna review this one this is APU Bonding Drop Concealer yang ni memang sangat-sangat sangat apa orang kata pekat dia tebal so benda ni you just can drop here just titik 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 and you can use it like that okay kita try belah kanan <coughs> ai dah lah ai rabun lah Dia pekat tau. Tapi dia mm, 70% coverage. 70%. Nampak? I pakai lighting matahari. So, you should see everything. Okay, next is not cosmetic. Not cosmetic ni sama macam Maybelline punya concealer. Tapi this like super expensive. Dia tak affordable. So, kalau korang nak, you better get the Maybelline. Cuma this... Oh, oh sakit je awak. Oh, ni. You just dot, dot dekat you punya ni. This like bentuk pen. Nampak tak ada pukat. Let's see if it can cover. Dia ada pilihan warna, tapi I terbeli yang terambil cerah. Warna yang terlampau cerah. So, dia dah jimat macam bertumpuk. So, what do you think? You rasa not cosmetic ni cover tak? For me, I think it's not like perfectly cover but it still can cover. You see? Still. Maybe you guys boleh tambah bagi di coverage. See? I paling suka this concealer. This is sumpah good. Sumpah really good. Korang patut beli same concealer. So, I'm sorry for this type of video. Sebab, I macam... I nak buat live video but cannot. Sebab, my sub tak sampai 1k yet. And so, korang jangan lupa sub my channel. And jangan lupa turn on post notification. And jangan lupa tengok semualah video-video I yang lama-lama. And hopefully, I can monetize by this year. InsyaAllah. So, korang kalau nak beli all uh, this for, this concealer, korang boleh tekan link dekat description box kat bawah. 
Kalau korang tak nak beli pun Kalau korang just nak tengok Korang boleh tekan link I just give you some Sort of Suggestion Tapi kalau korang yang macam I Yang suka jenis concealer Yang tak tebal Yang tak full coverage Sangat-sangat-sangat Yang bila Orang tengok dari jauh Oh dah tahu dia pakai concealer ah. Kalau tak nak yang macam tu Yang nak more like Natural-natural like Yang macam Korea-Korea punya Patut glow-glowing And korang patut get this First one is the same tip concealer. I punya shade 1.5. And the second one, kalau yang paling nipis, paling sangat-sangat nipis macam tak ada function, korang boleh beli Rimmel London Lasting Radiant. This is my favorite. I dah beli dua. This one pun I dah beli dua tapi botol lagi satu tu I dah buang. So, so far, the same punya is number one. So, kalau korang yang jenis suka Maybelline, it's okay. Just use it. Cuma macam I kalau korang perasan like some stuff of people, diorang tak suka benda yang keki bila dah pakai. Macam I, actually I tak cakap brand tu tak bagus as but I been using Maybelline since my high school. Since like high school bila eh? Umur like 2015, 16, 17, 19, 20. Uh, I been using that brand Maybelline concealer for 5 years already and I start to change sebab Kadang-kadang perubahan tu penting. So, see you guys on my next video. Maybe I nak review Obsessed Cosmetics. I akan review this Obsessed Cosmetic Cushion Foundation. So, kalau korang nak beli, jangan... Eh, kalau korang nak beli. Kalau korang nak tengok, make sure korang turn on post notification. Subscribe my channel. And kalau korang suka video ni, jangan lupa like. Kalau tak suka, tak apa. Jangan buat apa-apa. Jangan buat apa-apa. Okay? Bye!